Hello subbies and new buddies, welcome. You're watching an SNF gameplay of The Walking Dead. My name is Sunny. And uh, first things first, before you continue to watch this video, this video is not a blind gameplay. So if you want to see my first ever gameplay of The Walking Dead, here's the link. Now it's gone. I'm kidding. Yeah, here it is again. Alright, so what we're going to do in this uh, gameplay is uh, do all the sequences that we didn't do from before. As well as um, attempt to be funny. That's 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 definite goal. That's definite goal. So uh, another warning is that if once again, if you did not watch the Walking Dead gameplay yet, I may reveal a sequence or a cutscene before it actually happens. So please, please watch um, the original game, uh, the first gameplay of mine. Okay. So um, so don't, so don't, so no, no none of the cutscenes are ruined to you. Are ruined for you. Okay. So. What's if you hear a noise in the background? That's my roommate, and you can't stop those bitches from being loud. Nope, you cannot. So, here we are. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna start the game. I, uh, I, I, I feel the first recording. It's what, it's whatever. Standard. I can't do minimal. Whatever. Say. Okay. Oh, the goal here. Okay, so the goal here is since my last gameplay, I was the honest Lee. I want to be a total dickhead Lee. That's the plan. We're gonna be complete jerks. Just absolutely, just people want to kill us, not the zombies. Why do I mention Lee as if there's more than one of them? People want to kill him, not the zombies. Episode one, a new day. Yeah, I said it afterwards. I just, I don't know. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Controller. Oh, there's two. You know what they say about reckoning. I don't, but I reckon it's a lot like assuming. Yeah, something like that. You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Not for me. Because guys in your position already said it enough? Because I actually did it. We got what looks like a 1091 All cars have to keep on the lookout for 91 in the area. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Making boy. It's not every day a fella from Bibb County goes off and kills a state senator. That's for sure. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? Oh. You want to know how I see it? Not really. Well, too bad. It's my car. You might have the right to remain silent, but it don't mean I gotta be. <laughs> Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Oh, there it is. <laughs> what? Ryan is this game is preventing me from being a bad person. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. 
He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're all sitting. Officers are available for incoming to one. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Man. Man? <laughs> Not even close. They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Fucking this other time. We The weird thing is that all the, from all the sounds, you think like the police officer's body would be more chewed up, but it actually wasn't uh, at all. Nor was his clothes uh, clothes torn. Hey, hey, officer, are you all right? I'm still cuffed back here. Officer? He looked like he give a shoot. Oh, that doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the gun. No, he was not. No, you see that trail? The trail of oh, this? Why the hell did he have his gun out? Alright, we will go here and we will stomp him. Oh, there it is. Yeah. One more. Let's crawl. I need to drag myself out that oh, window. Okay, then. Uh, look at the door, use the mouse wheel, or number one, two, so like an action. I need to oh. drag myself out that window. Uh... Ah. I'm so curious how that happened, like the, the sequence of the car tumbling over. That's just hilarious to me, I have no idea why. Yeah, I'm using keyboard right now, so I'll give you my thoughts thoughts at the end of this episode and see right now if it was um, better or worse than the controller so that I used the controller first. Are you hey? The officer's shotgun is over there. <laughs> Why would he have needed that? You can pick up a shotgun, a barrel, but you can't uh, really. Okay. Okay, buddy, you are hilarious. You are hilarious. Officer? Officer? God damn. Officer? Hey, well, okay. Just get closer. Hey. That reaction right there, I, a lot of people had um, a good point about how they didn't know exactly that he was a zombie, so why would he be like, afraid? Mm. Officer? Ooh, hey. Uh, 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 holy shit! Oh, hey. 
Oh, oh no, 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 Oh no, no, come here, please. Yes, yes. Here we go. Sexy, yo. Look at that sexy message. Did he move? I don't know. Oh, we could, we could have a lot of time. Well, yeah, since the zombie was crawling and he didn't get up, I'm assuming his legs are like. crap. Shit! What the hell is this? Uh, there's Mandarin Orange over there. Help! Go get someone! There, there's been a shooting! What's over here? What's over here? Anything over here? Oh, I have to look over here? Oh, I look over here. <laughs> Mm, bone crack one. Every time he gets up, it's like it's all the. I forgot about that. I forgot. He gets. What is it? Careless? He gets clumsy? I, I don't know what the word is. But he just. The clutz? Clutz. He's a clutz. Absolutely. I know his head and his leg is like in pain. You know? I get that. It's just that. He knew the body was there, so it was very easy to Shootings over there. Hmm. They need five toys. <laughs> Look at the tea set by the tree. Hello, anybody? I'm I'm actually surprised that Mandarin Orange didn't like say, "Hey, I'm in a treehouse at this position." Since I called out, called out, I don't get why he didn't do such things, or she rather. Excuse me. T said hi. I'd fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. <laughs> and get drunk, because this is a horrible, horrible way to be in state of sober. Help! Yo, time to go swim, yo. Maybe I'll just go for a dip. Oh, funny man. The funny man. Not funny enough. What's over here? Maybe I should just check inside the house through the glass door before wandering out into the neighborhood. Hmm, maybe because that's part of the storyline, Lee? Hmm, maybe? Hmm? I wonder if anybody's home. I wonder if anybody's home. I wonder oh, if anybody's God, home. Sorry, guys. This is just. I, guess... I wonder if anybody's yeah, home. Wait, use moss wheel, right? Mo oh, I'll use mouse wheel. I get it now. Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. Coming in. That's what he said. Don't shoot, okay? That's what she said. Ah! Hello? Not an intruder, or one of them. These people might need more help than I do. Too free. Why not? It's Van Damme. 
I, I don't know. I want to attempt to avoid the senseless shit, but uh, if I didn't like encounter it the previous gameplay, I'd probably just do it here as well. Cause I like the the T set. I just noticed this gameplay, so maybe there's Ooh. something out there. Maybe, just maybe. Three new messages. Message one left at five forty three. Hey Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before the spring break. Message two, left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. The 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. There's Mandarin Orange, Mandarin Orange's mom, dad, all. Oh, Daddy? Huh? Hello? You need to be quiet. Uh, Are you okay? Oh, damn, you I'm this? okay. They tried to get me, but I'm hiding until my parents come home. They ain't gonna have a Mandarin orange. They ain't gonna shame. Mm -hmm. Hello? Did they get you? I I'm sorry. I'm here. What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. No, it's Mandarin uh, orange. Clementine. I'm Lee. Please don't go. How old are you? Eight. And you're all alone? Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. Okay, you're 37? Okay. This game is preventing me from being a dickhead, and it sucks. Where are your parents? Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? You know what do? You know what do instead? Maybe I'll probably like, like re, say the Atlantic. I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't and get make in. Make it sound mean. That's smart. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. What's up? <laughs> Oh shit, I'm hit! I'm hit! Oh oh! Oh, I'm hit! 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 I'm hit. Uh. I'm hit. Uh, oh! Oh, get ready. Wait. Kick it. Oh, oh, broke my knee again. That's, that's, that, yo, I propped that zombie. She is smart as hell. Beautiful. Oh, girl. Here you go. Sexy. Oh, yeah. Yo. Perfection. Per fucking perfection. Man. Hi there. You cool? Did you kill it? Yes. It's okay. Yep. I think she was a monster. You got that right. Uh, I think so too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. 
I I'm gonna. think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? All right, so this is one one of your first major decisions in the game. Uh, the sequence is not really affected by the choice. It's just that you're given a different like uh, path of what would happen, different cutscenes. So, since we did one of these already, I'm gonna pick the other one. And the other one is look for help. I'm sorry, get out of here once the sun goes down. So, we need to get out of this neighborhood. It's not safe. We're less likely to be seen if we move at night. My parents might come home. We won't go far. We'll try to find shelter and come back here with others. That sounds good. But we can hide in my treehouse until then. It'll be a tough climb with this leg, but that's a good idea. Let's go. Stay close to me. Now, let's stay quiet. We'll head out to the front yard and follow the road out of the neighborhood. Okay. It'll be okay. Stay near me, and we'll move as fast as we can. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of difficult to be a jerk. Well, maybe, maybe not to Clementine. She's cool. She gave me a hammer. I like her. She's awesome. So I'm just gonna be a dick to the other characters I encounter until they be helpful to me. Oh, you can coach all this area. Oh, you were you were in here before. I found the bastard. The fuck? Are we going to die? Was I just shot at? Stay down! Georgia State Patrol! Dude, he won't listen to that. We're friendly. There's a little girl here. Oh shit, you're not one of those things. Neither of us are. Oh damn, you've got a little girl. We're sorry about that. Well, Andre's sorry about that. Officer Mitchell. Nice name, Andre. My name's Sean. Sean Green. This is Andre. Officer Mitchell. <laughs> Did you see any of those things? One of them just got our buddy Chet. <laughs> I saw a lot in the forest, but that was a while ago. Yeah, one we're looking for is still in the neighborhood. Oh shit. You hurt your leg pretty bad. Look. Help us find the thing that got our buddy, and we'll take you and your daughter down to my dad's farm to safety. He should be able to fix your leg up, too. I'm not a dad. I'm... Just some guy. Just some guy. Some guy? Yeah. She's alone? Whoever you are, let's get a move on. We just were... Oh, hey, Chad. Oh, shit. It's Chad. Let's go! Get to my car! Go! Oh, he's not going to be going for supper. That's unfortunate for him. You guys can probably hear that in the background. Oh, my roommates. Loud bitches you ever meet. The loudest bitches you ever meet. Say hi to your dad for me. Yeah. I'm sorry, Sean. Chet was a good dude. One of the best. Take care of you two. Thank God you're okay. 
I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I ran into Andre outside of Atlanta, and, uh, Chet. He got killed. No. You're kidding. Those things got him. Dad, I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry, Sean. You've brought a couple guests. You need a place to stay. Now. Yeah. Need a place to stay. You're welcome to stay here, but just for the night. I don't run a bed and breakfast. Oh, So it's face. just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I also um, swam something. in zombie blood. I'm fine, though. I'm good. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch, and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. I'm Pip. Not too bad. I'm Pip. Tough guy, huh? What did you say your name was? I didn't. I didn't. Well, now's the time. Doesn't matter, right? Ha. Huh. Well, if you're gonna be here overnight, I'm gonna need it. Unless you'd rather hit the road. It's Lee. Well, Lee, just Lee, I take it. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Car accident. That's so. Where were you headed before the car accident? Nowhere. I was getting out of it. Oh, line. shit. Wrong the news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who were you with? The girl. I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine did, what you've been through. Did her just say daughter, even though I say I'm um, just some guy? Looking after her until we find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, I may, first I, thing tomorrow, I may, I may we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. But what happened to your friend? Maybe that's not a bad idea. It smells like... Shit. Shit. <gasps> I'm sorry. Shouldn't talk like that. What? No, damn it. It was a swear. Yo, man, they're oranges. If you can... Just I missed my mom and dad. Oh, I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. She's not allowing me being a jerk. She's like, I guess I have a soft side for Clementine. Damn it! I mean, mandarin oranges. Damn it! It's fine. It's fine. I love you, baby. <laughs> Bye. Fuck the senator. <laughs> Push you out the window. <laughs> Go straight back to sleep after that. Oh, wow. Hey, get up. <sighs> what an itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. It's weird how Duck is That's okay. That's my boy, Ken even Jr. Kenny call him Duck. Describe that he was nabbed almost. Oh my God. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad. See. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. 
Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Mandarin. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Oh, oh, check on Clarence time. Actually, you know, before I do anything, I think we'll end the episode here. I think I reached my mark. It's about 30 minutes. Yeah. So, if you, you want to see... Oh. It gets lots of Damn you, Kaja! If you want to see the next episode, please, uh, yeah, keep on watching. Thanks.